three groups of physicists have found a strong evidence for the existence of massless particles called WEYL fermions, found as the quasi-particles, which are the collective excitations of electrons. This discovery is massive as it could revolutionize electronics and quantum computing and we could just have taken a new leap forward as humanity, even though this discovery has over 80 years in the making, dating back to Paul Dirac. The spin of fermions was discovered in 1928 by Dirac who came up with its equation and discovered that in relation to particles that have charge and mass, there should be another particle and antiparticles known today as as electron and the positron that is its antiparticle. Please note that the fermions are at the building blocks that make up all matter. In 1929, enter Hermann Weyl, a German mathematician, came up with another solution that involved massless particles that hinted at a more exotic kinds of particles known for a number of years as Weyl fermions. But now, we have evidence that Weyl fermions actually exist. Physicists believe that neutrinos that are subatomic particles produced by the decay of radioactive elements were actually Weyl particles. More studies published in 1998 indicated that neutrinos do have mass, meaning that they cannot be the aforementioned Weyl particles. In 2014 at the University of Princeton, Zaid Hassan and his team found strong evidence of a great discovery of theirs and found this particles in the semi-metal tannatalum arsenide, referred to as TAAS, and that TAAS should contain Weyl fermionos and it should have what is known as fermiarch. Similar evidence was found by another team led by Hong Ming Wang at the Chinese Academy of Science and Marine Sol Jassik and colleague Shave seen evidence of Weyl fermions in a different material, specifically, a double gyroid photonic crystal, in this latter case. The team fired microwaves at the crystal and measured microwave transmission through it, varying the frequency of the microwaves throughout the experiment. Through this process, the team could map the structure of the crystal, allowing them to determine which microwave frequencies can travel through the crystal and which cannot. In the end, this revealed the presence of Weyl points in the structure which is strong evidence for Weyl fermion states existing within the photonic crystal. The importance of this find can't be overstated. Hassan is clear to point this out, noting in a press release that the physics of the Weyl fermion are so strange, there could be many things that arise from this particle that we're just not capable of imagining now. These are the fastest electrons that are Behaving like anadirectional light beams can can be used for new types of quantum computing in Soljasic. The head of the second study adds that the discovery of Weyl points is not only the smoking gun to a scientific mystery, it paves the way to absolutely new photonic phenomena and applications. Ultimately, it is believed Weyl fermions could be very useful, in that, because they are massless, they can conduct electric charge much faster than normal electrons. Admittedly, this same feature is exhibited by electrons in graphene, yet, graphene is a 2D material. Weyl fermions are thought to exist in more practical 3D materials.